Yo, what is going on, guys? My name is Sukun Stassen2 here, and in this video, I'm showing you guys an amazing trick that still works right now in Raven of Redwoods and in Spaceland. And this works on both consoles and can work either in a solo match or in a co op match with your friends. Either way, it will work no matter what. And this is an amazing trick. I mean, you can be getting loads of points on an early round, and you can be opening all the doors and even getting ready. For the SETI comms and even for the easter egg on both Raven Redwoods and Zombies to Spaceland. But other than that, this was found by Slick Caleb. By the way, big shout out goes to Slick Caleb for actually finding this. This is actually really cool and amazing for any of you guys who actually, like I said, want to actually complete the easter egg on a very, very low round. As I know, you guys are having trouble with the easter egg a lot, but... Other than that, let me actually show you guys how to do this trick or glitch in your own game. So before you even start the game up, you're needed to go into your Fate and Fortune cards and go into your deck and look for something called Punching Bags in the Fortune card section. As you're gonna need to equip punching bags in your deck for even this to even work. So make sure you have a Punching Bags card and then you can just start the game up once you have it into your card deck. And once your game has started, you're going to be looking around the map for something called the Rewind Grenade, which can be found at any kind of ticket booth standbys for 25 tickets. And once you have gotten your Rewind Grenade, you're going to be going and actually building any kind of trap besides the laser window trap, as that will definitely not work, as I got the electric trap, so you're beginning, like I said, any kind of trap besides the laser window trap. And second, you're going to be going into the Astrocade, and make sure that the power is on in the Astrocade and also in the Kepler system, but once you're ready to actually perform this glitch, you're going to be going up to the basketball game, and you're going to be going up to it, and you're going to be pushing left on the D-pad, and it should pull out your trap. Now, you're going to be pushing left on the D-pad, and you're going to be holding X or square and left on the D-pad again, and you guys should hear the basketball game start up and the trap right in front of you. Now at that point, you're going to be making your way down to the Kepler system as you're about to perform a god mode glitch. But once you are in the Kepler system, you're going to be going up to the crocodile right between these two lines on the ground right here. And once you're ready to actually do this god mode glitch, you're going to be running through the crocodile and you're going to be stopping exactly where I stop in the video for a millisecond, then push left on the d-pad and using that rewind grenade. And the crocodile should snap and actually kind of stop you but it should kind of glitch out with the basketball trap. Now, if you keep your rewind grenade, then you officially have done the god mode glitch, but if you got stuck and you officially are legit stuck for the entire game, you have to end the game, but once you have done the god mode glitch, you are in legit full god mode as nothing is going to be able to hurt you, not even the alien or any traps, but the thing is, is that I see a lot of your guys' comments saying that, hey, I keep dying and stuff from the alien and from the traps, you're a liar, but here's the truth. Here's why you are dying in the god mode glitch, and it's because you are going down the slide as once you're in full god mode and you go down the slide, and at that point, you have kind of eliminated most of the god mode glitch as now you're going to have that little hit detection on you and the alien's going to be able to hurt you and also the traps, so do not go down the slide if you want full god mode, but if you actually want this 40k kind of trick to go on you, you're going to have to go down the slide while you're in god mode, and all you have to do is just hoard up a bunch of zombies and you're just going to be activating that punching bags card and at that point you can just sit and relax as you're just going to be getting a load of money now you guys might be asking how is this going to be working on raven of redwoods now all you got to do is just activate god mode simply and then just go down the slide near bomb stoppers uh, around the campfire and that is it you will have that little head detection thing on and you can just activate that punching bags card once you do have a full horde on you and it's that easy guys it's very very simple i hope you guys have enjoyed this video and if you have any questions about this glitch or any of my glitches I do post, feel free to comment in the comment section below as I always try and respond to everyone's comment about my glitches I do post. But yeah guys, that's basically it. Hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Subscribe to watch the best glitches coming from my channel. Other than that guys, for Kunst2002, signing out.